All right, today we're going to bring a two-in-one, a duster, and a vacuum. Now, this is a perfect environment if you work with small enclosures like little computers, your keyboard, your mouse. Now, this is pretty much the whole entire package. It comes with a charging um, cable, which is a type C to type A, if you guys can see that. A couple nozzles, so this could be used to blow air or suck in particles, all right, so to clean up. Now, they give you even smaller ones, little small little nozzles, if you guys can see that, two of them. And then, of course, an extension if you want to extend it to a deeper area. And, of course, the actual vacuum itself, including with the filter, right? Now, this is, you don't need to replace the filter or buy a new one. This is a stainless steel. You could rinse it and wash it, or you just clean it up and dust it. Now, inside, there is a little filter in there, but it's pretty much the same thing. You could buy and replace the internal one, not the external one, all right? So very simple. We're going to put it together and see how it works. So for the vacuum part of it, you're going to have to remove the back end, right? And then you're able to set up this part, all right? So we're going to do the vacuum, and then we're also going to do the actual um, blower. So let's go ahead and do the vacuum first. It's, and it has a locking mechanism. It tells you if it's locked or unlocked. Right now, we have it locked on this area, but we can always unlock if you want to. Now, right now, what we're going to do is we're going to lock it in place in the back of it. And if you guys can see, I locked it in. And then you could change the actual nozzle. You could have a, a, a any kind of nozzle you want. You could have an extension, or you could just do it by itself. But today, there's only one of them that they're going to do. So we're going to do this one. We're going to actually clean our keyboard with this part of it. And if you want to blow some air, you can just add a secondary. But we're going to do one at a time. And then we're going to try it out. We're going to test it out with some rice, see how much rice it could pick up uh, and how fast it can do that. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, we're going to go ahead and set a couple of grain of rice in here, if you guys can see. Yeah. Now, to turn it on, you got to hold it on for two seconds, two or three seconds, and it turns on. If you hit it one more time, it goes to level three, all right? So let's go ahead and suck some of the air, um, particles that we have in here and see how fast it works. So we're going to hold down the button. That's level one, but we want it stronger. So we want two and then three. Bad. It's not bad. That was actually pretty quick, and it picked up all the rice in here. If you guys can see that, so you guys can see that it's actually working, and it's all in there. So that's not bad. That was pretty quick. So if you're gonna clean a keyboard, uh, perfect way to clean up a keyboard. So let's go ahead and do a test on uh, blowing off some air and cleaning up one of our laptops. So now we're gonna put it back to the normal way and back to the actual blowing air. And we wanna make sure we clean our fan because look how dirty it is in there, right? So we could brush it out too. I like to use this one too. So we could interchange with either one. So let's interchange that one. All right, because we have noise cancellation in the video, I'm gonna show you guys how to clean the actual with the vacuum. So I'm gonna click it once, that's level one. Level two. Level three. And then it goes off. Very powerful. I cleaned up the whole fan in here, if you guys noticed that. Very simple, easy to use.